Okay, Swirling Metal Spear. Your psychic senses tell you this is an important item. Keep this item. Move forward three spaces on the psycho scale. Okay. And keep this item and finish story card 23. All right. If you go to the pool house, go to story card 3. If you go straight into straight to the action of the gazebo I'm gonna go to 11 I'm trying to go by stuff I would normally wouldn't do you can tell that the pool house was once quite luxurious. It contains half a dozen private rooms with showers as well as an ornate mahogany bar in the common area. It must have been fun to hang out in this place in its glory days. Those thoughts fade as soon as a that sounds of a, a disturbance erupts from the top of the gazebo by the distance. And now you can hear a lone violin playing a soothing melody. Okay, we can either investigate the gazebo or the sound of the violin. I don't want to investigate the sound of the violin, that sounds da dangerous. So we're going to go to story card nine. You sprint the gazebo, practically pushed along by the winds that are picking up. A, slight, a light sprinkling of rain splatters the ground as you run. You make it to the shelter of the structure and the mayhem occurring above you on the roof increases in intensity. Who is up there and what are they doing, you wonder. You notice a driveway in 20, about 20 feet away. If you are at level 2 or higher, yes I am. Okay, psychic. Oh my gosh, this thing's weird. I have no idea what to make of this right now. Oh, it's a key. To a door. A door hole. Okay. So I can keep this here. Okay. I'm going to climb the top of the gazebo. You stand in the gazebo's railing, steadying yourself by gripping an ornate post holding up the roof. The rumbling above sounds and feels frightening. What are you getting yourself into? The reluctant to barge into the middle of the situation. You raise yourself just enough for a peek and discover that there is no gazebo roof. The motion is actually a large satellite dish broken into pieces. The big jagged fragments are still connected to the base by wires, and violent winds are spinning them in a circle with great force. Feeling wildly like an angry octopus, the satellite dish almost hits you in the face. You might be able to grab a piece by a piece zooming by. Okay. Right. Gonna go for it. Required challenge. I don't have anything to help me since required. Automatic fail. So auto fail. I get clue 17 instead. Your fingertips graze a piece of the satellite dish, but you can't quite grab it. You reach too far, lose your balance, and tumble from the gazebo down a short hill. 
hear confusion from the fall slowly subsides and you hear the sound of a beautiful violin nearby. You stumble off in the direction of the music. Hmm. And then we go to story card 17.